Hi. Welcome to Just Trading. In this video, our team give you an analysis with the information we got after the closing day of September 17, 2021. Our objective is to give you suggestions to trade with less risk and higher capital return. Remember to stop the video at any time, if you want to look at it carefully. Here, we show you an example of the stock's timestamp that you can find on the video's comments. You can click on the timestamp and go to the stock's details. SP500 ETF belongs to the bear high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Dow Jones Industrial ETF belongs to the bear normal class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. NASDAQ 100 ETF belongs to the bear high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Corporate bond ETF belongs to the trade high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the market sectors table. There is a strong opportunity to buy material sector EDF. You can observe, it has an expected buyer return of 2.4%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $83.32. For a vertical call option, an estimated price is at $0. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to sell. Energy sector ETF belongs to the bull low class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of energy sector. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to buy. On the other hand, there is a strong opportunity to sell ConocoPhillips company. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 2.3%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $58.28. For vertical put option, an estimated price is at $0.3. Chevron Corporation was a previous suggested short stock. Today, we suggest to buy it. The Williams Companies was a previous top seller alternative. Today, our analysis is suggesting to continue holding it short. You can observe that the Williams Companies is a trade high class. In the past, it has given an average sell return of 0.7%. You may expect now a sell return of 0.9%. We suggest to buy it at a maximum price of $25.06, but we expect a possible buy price of $24.83. On the other hand, we suggest to stop selling if the price is $25.36, unless is overvalued. Financial sector ETF belongs to the bear high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the stock stable of financial sector. There is a strong opportunity to buy MasterCard Incorporated. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 1.8%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $382.8. For a vertical call option, an estimated price is at $1.55. On the other hand, there is a strong opportunity to sell Wells Fargo. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 1.5%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $46.05. For a vertical put option, an estimated price is at $0.23. BlackRock was a previous top buy alternative. Today, our analysis is suggesting to continue holding it long. You can observe that BlackRock is a bare normal class. In the past, it has given an average buy return of 3.0%. You may expect now a buy return of 3.4%. We suggest to sell it at a minimum price of $906.3. On the other hand, we suggest to stop buying if the price is $876.63, unless is undervalued. Morgan Stanley was a previous suggested iron condor option. 
The sell put strike price was sold at $99. The buy put strike price was bought at $102. The buy call strike price was bought at $104. And the sell call strike price was sold at $106. We are holding it, unless we decide to sell it before the expiration date on September 24, 2021. PayPal Holdings was a previous suggested iron condor option. The sell put strike price was sold at $272.5. The buy put strike price was bought at $287.5. The buy call strike price was bought at $292.5. And the sell call strike price was sold at $302.5. We are holding it, unless we decide to sell it before the expiration date on September 17, 2021. Real estate sector ETF belongs to the bear high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of real estate sector. There is a strong opportunity to buy Prologis. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 5.0%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $132.37. For vertical call option. An estimated price is at $0. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to sell. Healthcare sector ETF belongs to the bare normal class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of healthcare sector. There is a strong opportunity to buy Medtronic PLC. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 3.1%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $132.76. For a vertical call option, an estimated price is at $0. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to sell. Pfizer Incorporated was a previous suggested iron condor option. The sell put strike price was sold at $43.5. The buy put strike price was bought at $44.5. The buy call strike price was bought at $44.5. And the sell call strike price was sold at $45.5. We are holding it, unless we decide to sell it before the expiration date on September 24, 2021. Industrial sector ETF belongs to the bare normal class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of industrial sector. There is a strong opportunity to buy Union Pacific. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 3.1%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $214.48. For a vertical call option, an estimated price is at $0. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to sell. Caterpillar Corporation was a previous suggested short stock. Today, we suggest to buy it. Caterpillar Corporation was a previous suggested vertical put option. Today, we suggest to sell it. FedEx Corporation is a strong buy suggestion. It is on a bare low class. In the past, our analysis shows you that it has given an average buy return of 1.3%. You may expect now a buy return of 1.9%. We suggest to buy it at a maximum price of $256.33. But we expect a possible buy price of $251.24. In addition, we suggest to stop buying FedEx Corporation, if it is below 3.25% of your stock price trade. This is a new buy suggested vertical call option. On the table, FedEx Corporation has a buy call strike price at $257.5 and a sell call strike price at $262.5. For this spread option, it will expire on September 24, 2021, and the estimated price is at $1.14.
Material Sector ETF belongs to the Bear Normal class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of Material Sector. There is a strong opportunity to buy DuPont Dinamores. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 2.7%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $71.33. For vertical call option, an estimated price is at $0.42. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to sell. DuPont Denimores is a strong buy suggestion. It is on a bare normal class. In the past, our analysis shows you that it has given an average buy return of 4.9%. You may expect now a buy return of 2.7%. We suggest to buy it at a maximum price of $71.33, but we expect a possible buy price of $69.19. In addition, we suggest to stop buying DuPont and Moore's. If it is below 1.90% of your stock price trade, this is a new buy suggested vertical call option. On the table, DuPont Dinamores has a buy call strike price at $70, and a sell call strike price at $72. For this spread option, it will expire on September 24, 2021, and the estimated price is at $0.42. Discretionary Sector ETF belongs to the Trade Normal class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the stock's table of discretionary sector. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to buy. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to sell. McDonald's was a previous suggested vertical put option. Today, we suggest to sell it. Tesla Incorporated was a previous suggested butterfly option. The two buy calls strike price were bought at $740, and at $760, and the sell call was sold at $750. We are holding it, unless we decide to sell it before the expiration date on September 24, 2021. Consumer Staples ETF belongs to the Bear High Class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of Staples sector. There is a strong opportunity to buy ST Lauder. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 5.6%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $322.86. For vertical call option, an estimated price is at $0. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to sell. CVS Health Corporation was a previous suggested butterfly option. Today, we suggest to sell it. Technology Sector ETF belongs to the Bear High Class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the stocks table of technology sector. There is a strong opportunity to buy Qualcomm company. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 3.9%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $139.46. For vertical call option, an estimated price is at $0.01. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to sell. Advanced Micro Devices was a previous suggested short stock. Today, we suggest to buy it. Advanced Micro Devices was a previous suggested vertical put option. Today, we suggest to sell it. Applied Materials was a previous suggested short stock. Today, we suggest to buy it. Applied Materials was a previous suggested vertical put option. Today, we suggest to sell it. 
communication sector ETF belongs to the bear high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the stock's table of communication sector. There is a strong opportunity to buy Comcast Corporation. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 5.0%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $57.64. For vertical call option, an estimated price is at $0.23. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to sell. Utility sector ETF belongs to the bare normal class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the stock's table of utility sector. There is a strong opportunity to buy Nextera Energy. You can observe, it has an expected buy return of 3.1%. You may buy it at a maximum price of $84.27. For vertical call option, an estimated price is at $0. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to sell. Bitcoin, thousands, belongs to the bear high class. Today, our analysis does not list it as a suggestion to buy or sell. Let's look at the cryptocurrencies table. Our analysis does not list the top opportunity to buy. On the other hand, there is a weak opportunity to sell Cosmos. You can observe, it has an expected sell return of 16.9%. You may sell it at a minimum price of $36.92. Cosmos is a weak sell suggestion. It is on the bear high class. In the past, our analysis shows you that it has given an average sell return of 2.2%. You may expect now a sell return of 16.9%. We suggest to sell it at a minimum price of $36.92, but we expect a possible sell price of $38. In addition, we suggest to stop selling Cosmos if it is over 2.10% of your stock price trade. Litecoin is a mild sell suggestion. It is on a trade normal class. In the past, our analysis shows you that it has given an average sell return of 2.5%. You may expect now a sell return of 10.9%. We suggest to sell it at a minimum price of $169.47, but we expect a possible sell price of $200.5. In addition, we suggest to stop selling Litecoin if it is over 3.20% of your stock price trade. Tron, since, was a previous suggested short cryptocurrency. Today, we suggest to buy it. This ends the analysis of our team that gives you a good start on your trading day. Please, remember to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Share it and leave it a like if you find it useful. Thanks for following us. We hope to see you on our next Just Trading video. Bye.